Merci. <rire> I can't stop thinking about you. Hello and welcome back to Lorefan Gaming Plays Fable Anniversary. I'm your host Lorefan. In this Fable Anniversary Evil Path Part 36 video, we're doing the side quest called The Ransom Victim and the main The Lost Chapter story quest called The Prophecies of the Fire Heart. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Do not forget to hit notification bells to be updated and much more. Now, you definitely want to get this quest. And great news, there's a good and evil path, so let's go ahead and grab it now. I am going to go ahead and grab the Ransom Victim. Now, this quest, the good and evil path, is actually at the end on uh, who you take the uh, person that's being kidnapped to. The location we're going to is Nuthole Glade, and we're going to go ahead and see the Nuthole Glade Chieftain. Yeah, the same one I was tempted to uh, murder. I couldn't find him. And also, he's the uh, fist fighting champion of Albion, which uh, he was, now I am. So you uh, go this way, then you will uh, not only get a cutscene, you also will get the uh, older brother of the victim talking to you. So yeah, you have a choice, the father or the older brother who you turn in the brats. So let's go ahead and trigger this cutscene now. Oh, a hero at last. It's my youngest son. He's been captured by bandits. I've told him never to go play in the woods. They say they'll send me his head if I don't pay the ransom. Oh, why does everything happen to me? Why? They're holding him in a cave in Witchwood, those filthy savages. You have to rescue him. Here's the ransom gold. If you can kill the lot of them, it's yours to keep. Just make sure my son is unharmed. Oh, I must lie down now in my hut. This is all too much. Hey, over here. So, you're off to free my little brother, are you? That's just lovely. Lovely. But you know, my father is a stupid old man. Can you believe he's talking to making the brat the next chief around here? We can't let that happen, my friend. It would be the end of this town. If you want to make some serious gold, bring the boy to me. I'll be waiting for you on the secluded path on the opposite side to the demon door. Here's the deal. We got the ransom money. If we want to pay it off, we can. I'll explain that when we get down the line why we're not doing that. Still, I also will explain one thing I need to tell everybody. Since this is the Lost Chapters expansion, what happened was the developers did something uh, good. If you destroy the Sword of Aeon, so this way you spare your sister, you will get the uh, quest that's an alternative to the Sword of Aeons. I heard it's almost the same as the Sword of Aeons, but still, if you're on the good path, get ASAP before starting this quest. So I'm going to go zone in the next area and test out my new toy. I'm going to definitely say this, the Sword of Aeons is the second best weapon game overall, best melee weapon ever. Now the uh, honor is the uh, Boat of Scorms by uh, going to the Chapel of Scorms and sacrificing fools until you get enough points to get said bow. Yeah, you definitely want the bow for the lost chapters, you'll really cheese it. 
Sword's good too, but I felt like the bow's better. Still, if I cannot use a bow or arrow, I'll just bust this out. I'm going to go ahead and take this fool out before going to the next area and clear it all out. Now, there's a Balverines. I, sh I mean, uh, Balverines. And you want to do is, if you want to, clear them out or just ignore them. Just zone as fast as possible to get to the demon door. Up to everybody on uh, that. Let's go on in. Okay. Oh, wow. There's these bugs. I really don't recognize them. Oh, wow. There's a lot of them. They're going to die like only one, two hits. Renown's like one. So they're like use useless and uh, pitiful. But, oh, wow. That is uh, neat, though. So we're going to go ahead and get to the next zone at this uh, very moment. Then I'll explain about the uh, ransom, why you should not do it. Here's the deal on why you should not do the ransom. First of all, if you did the ransom, bandit foes will disappear for the rest of this side quest. Instead, you have to face off against Balverines, trolls, or anything else that is really nasty. So I'm going to say it's definitely avoid paying the ransom. In fact, if you want to go the extra mile, just simply kill the fools outside. Now, if you don't pay the ransom, the uh, high rate of foes is, uh, I think it's 90% bandits, maybe 10% balverines. Not too hard since you could use range to go ahead and headshot them big time. Uh, let's uh, go ahead and take care of this fool. Also, uh, this one too. Yeah, I need some evil points because I am kind of low on evil points. And I want those red eyes back. So I'm going to go ahead and kill the uh, guys guarding the demon door. And here we go. You heroes always have to stick your nose into everything, don't you? Well, as long as you've got the gold, the boss won't mind. Go right in. Don't get any bright ideas, though. We'll be waiting right here. Whoops. What's the big idea? Attacking my people! The ransom just went up! Now hand the gold over. Any more of your funny stuff and the kid leaves in pieces. First you attack my boys, and now you won't pay? Oh, I guess you won't mind if we spill the kid's guts out then! Wow, a real hero, and you saved me. I can't believe how lucky I am. Bandits and a hero in one day. I suppose we should get going then. That man you killed is starting to smell funny. I bet we see more bandits though, and they won't be happy you killed their boss. <laughs> Here's how the escort parts works with the little brat. First of all, you have to uh, go from outside the demon door to not hold glade. Yeah, you're going to have to fight your way through. Bad idea just to run. No, you have to clear the entire area. Use any method necessary. This looks exciting. Alright, we got this area done. We're going to go ahead and get the uh, next one. As I mentioned definitely before, I'm going to remind everybody once again. 
clear out all the foes that you're going in a path. Don't leave any behind because they might attack the brat and kill him and you will fail in the quest. So let's go ahead and uh, fight in the next area. I didn't realize those bandits had taken me so far away. Slow time definitely saved my butt big time. It made things a lot more easier. And okay, I'm trying not to kick the corpse. I'm gonna go ahead and headshot these two fools because I can. Yeah, see the uh, bow of scorms? Yeah, it's very powerful. It, it could do a n nice, nasty headshot. So let's clear out the uh, next area. Here's the deal about the uh, alignment path. So once you get to not hold glade with the little brat alive and definitely well, you have a simple choice. Either turn in the little brat to the big brother or his father. So let me go ahead and explain the alignments on that. Good alignment. That means you turn him into the father. Quest complete. Now I am doing the opposite uh, way, which is the evil alignment by turning in the little brat to the big brother. Besides, it's much better results in the entertainment field. So what I'm going to do right now is go ahead and talk to the big brother, claim my reward, and the quest will definitely be complete. So long, brat. Hey, nice work, hero. You've earned your keep. You won't believe where I've been. I was in this cave, and there were these bandits, and... Yeah, yeah, keep your mouth shut, you little squirt. I'm going to show you what those bandits should have done. Really? Cool. Is there going to be swords? There just might be. I'll have to deal with crazy old dad next. Everybody knows I should be the chief. 
I wonder what I should do with your body. Bury it here? Nah. I think I'll just dump it in Witchwood Gorge. Oh, yes! The gorge, please. It's brilliant there. The quest is now complete, so we're going to go ahead and officially start the Lost Chapter quest. Is now, the uh, first one that will point you in the right direction is at Lookout Point. So we're going to the Guild Hall, then we get to the Lookout Point. Once we arrive there, then the uh, quest will definitely start. There will be a puzzle solution. I'll tell everybody on how the puzzles work when we arrive on the first one. But for now, this is a great time to definitely go ahead and save the game. You may never know what happens, so as soon as I get outside, a uh, cutscene will definitely happen. Many have died. I believe these creatures are known as summoners. My mission here has failed. I will attempt to stop their passage to the mainland. But I require assistance. The strongest among you must open the primal demon door close to this podium. It holds the fire heart. Only the chosen one will gain audience with the prophets. Use the heart to call the ship of the drowned. Hurry before all is lost. Scythe? Scythe! Lost him. Scorn! The Demon Door awoke this morning, but none of us could get through. It says we're not worthy. It is up to you, hero. If you defeated Jack single-handedly, if it will not open for you... The man's got a point. I'll stick to my speciality and hit the books. We need to know what these summoners are. Good luck. You bear the mask of Jack of Blades. The prophets had foreseen the coming of such a legend among heroes. The rise of the summoners in the northern wastes marks the arrival of a new threat to all things living. We have long dreaded this portent. Behind my walls lies the Fireheart. There, you will speak to the prophets who watch over it. You may enter now. But beware the beating of the heart. It has burned many before you. We are the prophets of the fire heart. It was your destiny to seek us out, hero. The beast arises in the frozen north. Only he who claims the heart can stop it. Its mystical powers will guide you across the sea. There you must face a force of such evil. Not even death can silence its fury. Oh, for crying out loud! Just tell him to get us out of here! Yes, yes, we were coming to that. To obtain the Fireheart, you must solve the mystery of day and night. And we'll finally be free! Witness the board before you. Each time you turn all the moons into suns, you'll release one of us from our perpetual prison. But fill the board with moons and one of us will perish, and the Fireheart will never be yours. What? I thought you said he'd get it even if he gets us all killed. I heard you. To quiet you, imbecile! Look, it's very simple. Solve the damn puzzle, you get the heart, we get out of this hole! Everyone's happy, all right? Here is how this puzzle works. You need to turn all moon tiles into sun tiles. If you turn them all sun into moons, you will take damage. Now there's a timer. If you're too slow and time runs out, you will take damage. I think if you take too much damage, you will uh, die. If you get all suns, you move to the next puzzle. Then you rinse and repeat until all five are done. So I'm gonna go ahead and do them now. I'll be back after everything is done. Thank you, hero. Use the fire heart wisely. Oh, I hope 
pie getter. Moon to sun. That's good. Sunny! Sunny! Oh, what's happening? The light is so beautiful. M Mother, I'm coming! Excellent! Just free me next, and you can do what you like. That's the one! Now keep going! That's it! That's it! Nearly there! Yes! Freedom at last in your face! Eternal confinement! You are wise and benevolent, hero. Ah! A noble move! Careful! You shall be punished if you take much longer. Ha <laughs> ha! You are a true gentleman. Just... I shall join my fellow prophets now. Cheerio! Good! Just don't mess it up! That's it! Sun signs! Now get on with it! Come on! Don't stop now! Chop, chop! Hey, uh, you're not too bad, you know. Uh, I'll send you a postcard sometime. the fire heart? Excellent. I knew you'd be able to do it. So, have a nice chat with the prophets. I should have known they'd let you in. I've been looking into these summoner creatures and, well, I don't know what you had to do to get the Sword of Aeons, but boy, am I glad you did. These things are bad. I'm sure he'll be able to deal with them, Briar. He did defeat Jack, after all. Your next step is to place the fire heart in the Hook Coast Lighthouse. Its power will summon the ship that will carry you to the northern wastes. Good luck once more, hero. Yes, I uh, did it. The quest is complete. Completed five puzzles. Got the fire heart. So here's a recap for this video. I start off with the ransom victim by helping out the not whole glaive chieftain. Well, not really. Found the brat. Instead of giving the brat to the father, I gave the brat to the older brother. I hope he takes really good care of him, if you know what I mean. Then start the prophecies of the fire heart. Complete all five puzzles and got the fire heart itself. Well, everyone, this is it for my fable anniversary. You will pat part 36, the ransom victim, and the prophecies of the fire heart video. This is Lord Fenton sign off. Thanks for watching and have a great day or night. Please stay safe. Please subscribe to my channel for more content like this. If you like what you see, then pick my suggestion on the upper left hand corner or YouTube suggestion on the bottom left hand corner. Have a great day or night and do some serious damage in video games.